News Army. New facts emerge in the abduction and death of a Memphis jogger. As investigators in Memphis unveiled new information about the abduction of jogger Eliza Fletcher, the suspect in the tragic abduction appeared in court on Wednesday to face murder charges. 38-year-old suspect Cleotha Abston Henderson appeared in Shelby County Criminal Court to face accusations of first-degree murder, premeditated murder, and first-degree abduction. The court ordered his detention without bond awaiting a bond hearing. Henderson entered no plea in this case. Attorney Jennifer Case of the Shelby County Public Defender's Office notified the court that while Henderson stated he wanted her office to represent him, she submitted a motion expressing concerns about that representation that the court did not make public. Judge Louis J. Montesi Jr. ordered the defendant to return to court on Thursday as he attempted to fix the representation problem. In light of Ms. Case's concerns, which I won't discuss until I can hopefully fix them by tomorrow and find you another attorney if necessary, Montesi told Henderson, who appeared in court shackled and under heavy protection. In light of the defendant's statement confirming his true name, Montesi said he would refer to the defendant as Cleotha Henderson. The suspect was originally known as Cleotha Abston by police and prosecutors. Henderson has been in court twice before. According to Shelby County District Attorney Steve Mulroy, he was arraigned on Tuesday on counts of particularly aggravated abduction and tampering with evidence concerning Fletcher's disappearance. Henderson was also charged over the weekend with offenses unrelated to Fletcher's kidnapping, including identity theft, theft of items worth less than $1,000, and fraudulent credit card usage.